All right, 2014 Jetta TDI. Um, uh, wife came out here uh, the other morning, um, yesterday morning, tried to start this vehicle. Um, it had been sitting outside for uh, a few days, uh, getting down in the teens at night. Uh, anyway, it wouldn't start. I thought maybe it was a glow plug issue or something. It was coming up with a 236, 237 error. Um, something about an air input sensor, uh, you know, uh, fault. And uh, online it said uh, a couple of different things to check. It said, you know, any kinked hoses or whatever. Anyway, I, I noticed that every time when you tried to crank on it, this main hose right here below the throttle body, an air intake would collapse, would just like collapse right in, suck right in like it was a restriction of some sort. So I opened up that clamp right there, put that screwdriver in there to go and give it some air, and it started right away. So I brought it in the shop, called the dealer, uh, brought it in the shop, tried to let it warm up overnight, and uh, um, before I went ahead and I did some other reading, and they were talking about possible like ice, you know, uh, the dealer said that it might be uh, water and ice accumulated in this intercooler area below that throttle body. Um, and that would be causing a restriction. So I googled it. And uh, yeah, I guess it's a major problem. You know what I mean? Volkswagen has a fix for it, but it's case by case basis. Uh, you know, it's not a problem until it's a problem, uh, which kind of sucks because it's a problem for me now. Um, but uh, this vehicle's got the extended warranty. But uh, shit, you know, we live on the country. I'm 45 minutes away. You know what I mean? Um, I need my vehicle. And if it's just something simple as water, I mean, hell, uh, we just had to sing in for a winter time uh, service, and uh, I'm, I've never worked on a Volkswagen. It took me a whole five minutes to go ahead and drop this pan, 12 screws, and then one whole clothes clamp. You know, wish some guys would have just did it right there in the shop, drained the damn water. I probably wouldn't be having this problem. I wouldn't even know that this problem existed, which maybe it's, this is a godsend that this is happening to me. <laughs> That's the way things happen in my life. Anyway, um... That's it. So uh, I came down, came on here, dropped this pan. This thing was so solid with ice, I went ahead and put a little indirect heat with my heat gun on here, kind of warm things up a little bit. I'm surprised there's no cracks or anything in this plastic jobby. Um, um, I've seen some guys, they drill a little piss hole right here, drain that water. Um, I guess it would only drain, um, you know, during uh, when the vehicle's off, because this sucks air. Um, you know, and I guess you wouldn't want to have a hole right here sucking air and mud. You know, air, uh, water and mud and all that, but shit, if this thing's full of water, you know, your engine's sucking in, you know, water, you know, basically into the crank, you know, into the uh, intake manifold and all that. That ain't good either. You know, I noticed this fucking vehicle just started to run like a little bit of shit. Like I said, I'm surprised you didn't catch that during that winter interval, uh, winter service or whatever. But anyway, um, uh, yeah, so I got a heat gun on there and uh, this thing is starting to thaw up a little bit. Um, you know, you can feel there. This sucker was solid. There's still, it's still pretty solid over here, you know. But right here by this main area, and I'm able to go ahead and just. I know it's starting to thaw a little bit, and right now is the moment of truth. I'm gonna see if I can't get this on, bitch, completely. Oh, it's the mother lord. Woo! I mean, holy shit! You know, call the kids in Africa, man. We got. You know, we got fresh water over here, bud. Woo! Oh, man. Holy, oh, look at this. Man, it said it'd probably be a big old chunk of ice in there. They weren't kidding. Man, this is like, oh! <laughs> that's, a, that's the sucker that sank the Titanic. Holy moly. Ah, oh, but look at that shit. I noticed there's a little bit of fucking... A little oil residue up in there. Hopefully that's just from that freaking rebreather air, funky ass air coming through there and shit. You know, fucking uh, oily and f crap. But anyway, shit. There's another chunk of ice right in inside this this thing too. I wanted, like I said, I had a heat gun on there indirectly. You know, to go ahead and see if we couldn't uh, um, heat that up a little bit. And now that I got some heat on there. There's another fucking chunk of ice in here that hasn't come loose yet, so I'm just going to let that drip. Um, and then see if this damn thing here, like I said, we could get this chunk of ice out of there. You know, that's the thing. Dealer said, uh, see if this, this would actually go ahead and... Uh, he said, get in the shop. Dealer said, get it in the shop, and then, uh, if, it, and then if it starts... Then you know that it, the ice was your problem. And I'm thinking to myself, after reading online that Google searched it, you know, all this ice chunks and stuff loosening up, you know, and then starting and this thing sucking in towards that throttle body. I don't want these ice chunks going inside my engine. 
you know, I was so reading that that might cause trouble too. So I was just like, well, I'm gonna go ahead and take care of the damn problem. You know what I mean? Look at that. There, I got all kinds of more ice coming out of there. I can feel it. There's there's like a big old thing of ice in there. You know, but uh, here, get a little screwdriver action here. Let's see if I can pick that out of there. Nope. I have to wait for that th at the thaw. But anyway. Again, uh, Volkswagen's got some sort of fix for this. We know some de-icing thing. It's supposed to go ahead and intermittently, you know, burp out some water, you know, drain the water out of there. Um, but uh, that's it. Um, hopefully this is my problem, man, because I ain't got time for problems, you know what I mean? That's it. <sighs>